How were you guys able to weather the storm, or do you think a big part of it was kind of getting ahead of the curve first? And I got lucky in that when I launched, it was cheap to advertise, so I was able to build a pretty large community before anybody else. So I had a head start. I also made very good relationships with tons of watch brands. So when a company would pop up, they're already like the companies are already working with me, and they don't want to alienate my business. Where I mean, let's say I'm buying, I'm going to buy a thousand watches from you next month. They're not going to potentially risk that business to sell tens this new company you know and honestly i've been i got reached out to by some brands and i was like yes sell, sell to them of course like i like healthy competition actually i'm not trying to like ruin somebody yeah like fuck you a little bit for stealing my idea but let's go let's let's put the companies up against each other and see what happens